What does one say about their own art? I guess you start with your influences. I am deeply steeped in the work of artists in the 20th and 21st century, but really the biggest influence on the current state of my art is Aboriginal art of Australia. I spent a year in and traveling through the country, and while in the outback, I went to a town called Lightning Ridge. This is said to be the place the great serpent of creation scraped its belly across the earth, leaving the ground rich in beautiful opals. It was the natural shapes and repeating patterns that drew me in, but my style has more to it. It has texture reminiscent of Van Gogh, repetition like that of Chuck Close, a simplicity found in the works of Roy Lichtenstein. Salvador Dali is a big influence to me in a more subcontextual way. The color scheme is unique and psychedelic in nature, and I don't really know what influence to attribute that to. Next, about the process. I start my canvas with a simple drawing and pencil and find my way into working with moving shapes. After that, I put a few layers of acrylic paint. This is where the mood of the painting is born. If I'm feeling one way, it might be monochromatic and valid. If I'm feeling differently, it might have a more robust and muddled color. The next step is to add layers upon layer of puff paint, usually used for fabric, but I find this provides incredible texture that allows my work to have many dimensions to it. Where is my art going? What can I say? I don't really know what inspires me to create. I know just that I have an unending desire. My paintings have in the past have had a political theme, and I see using that in the future more. I want to start working on larger canvases because the bigger the canvas, the longer it takes to walk by. Right now, the budget restraints are an issue. It's also tough being an artist who is introverted and isn't really good at selling their work to viewers. But I am undaunted in my struggle to make my artistic work.